looks like they came around and just put flags by everybody's mailbox. I want a swastika in my mind. <laughs> yeah, that's a fucking fantastic that symbolizes idea. symbolizes white supremacy. <laughs> so you really are a fucking racist, huh? No, that's, that's... no, I'm not. No, I'm not. But like other races, you learn from the white man. The white Aryans, as we call them, you learn from them. The other races wouldn't be anywhere if they hadn't learned from them. Is that right? You better not, if you spill any of that shit in no, here, you're gonna fucking eat it off the floor. <laughs> <laughs> I don't let my kids eat in the car. I shouldn't be letting you eat in here. You're, you're more of a pig than they are. Yeah, God but damn it, this fucking... At least you're teaching them manners. It was funny, they had a sign in front of this development, I'm still there. Independence Day Parade, Saturday morning at 9.30. So, that's the time I do my cardio. So, it was going by the clubhouse. I actually ride my bike around there, like five laps. So, I see these kids with their parents. They must have been like six, eight years old. On these little bikes with American flags and ribbons and stuff. And they're laying on the ground after walking about 10 feet. Oh my God. Uh, I want to go inside. Oh yeah, they can't take the heat. Man. I'm tired. And the parents are like bringing them drinks and shit. I was like. What the fuck is wrong with that? Because they walk 10 feet. They're supposed to do a parade around the neighborhood. And the kids stop complaining. Well, you know, kids are lazy these days, man. They don't. Where was the belts at? I mean, they had a big sign, and there was actually people standing. There. Where were the belts? There at? were people standing outside their homes. Old people waiting to see it. What belt? What are you talking about? A belt? Like? Oh, a, like if my didn't want this, and my father would. He'd unleash his belt so fast um, it would like. It, it obviously whoop. fucking worked very well. And smack my me and my sister, and my brother. Yeah, that's that's good twenty hard rocks. You do. Here's fucking Jason calling. Let, let me answer it. Let's see what what this Nimrod has to say. What's up, shit lord? Are you here? No, if I was there, you'd see me, you asshole. <laughs> me and Lenny are in the car driving there. We're stuck at a light, and he's... All right. All right. Jesus Bye -bye. Christ. Sounds like a woman. Huh? Sounds like a woman. He's got a kind of a high-pitched voice a little bit. That steak doesn't look bad, actually, even though you're a disgusting animal. It's a great meal. You got all your pre-workout shit in and... No, I didn't take that. I gotta take that. So I, I can't go into the weights. I gotta wait. I tell you what, though. I was looking on back page. You're like a fucking high, high maintenance female. Jesus Christ. Everything's like... Why, why are you torturing yourself with this regimen, man? What are you fucking... You have to eat every three hours. Yeah. You gotta nap every... every well, the... Do you take naps at work? I can't. I'm like a machine at work. I, and my biggest thing at work is, you know, everyone complains and stuff. I, I never complained in almost 30 years. Things people don't do, I'll do it. And I won't brag, but well, there's a, the there's, a, there's a, yeah, there's a lot of shit that nobody will do that you will fucking do. That's, and, uh, that's a fucking understatement if I ever heard the, uh, the complainers, the porch monkeys. I come in. They'd be trying to. I heard them talk amongst themselves. They'd be trying to work a nigger to death around here. <laughs> and I'm thinking, what? Getting up and fucking. Everyone straighten need, that up before you spill it. On everyone yourself. needs a push card to. For, they got a case of this in case that. Who do be taking my cart? So I never use a cart. All I like, carry like 30 cases of. You know, there's a little stocking. Bunch of scum. <laughs> All Trump haters, no. all Democrats, human filth—the opposite of you, Brad. Yeah. <laughs> I, I mean, I saw well, you you're, working. You bust your ass. Yeah, it's fucking. This time of year is a pain in the balls, man. It is fucking hot out. Just not supposed to say. I lose it. about ten just pounds. Just don't say. Oh, you do, but no, just don't, I don't say. Just, Dude, I grew up here. It's not. Right. It is what it is. I didn't, but. I will not live in an air-conditioned home anymore. That's a fact. I did that one year with a Haitian man. 
Oh, Unless I, I had a fan on me, I was gushing sweat 24 Yeah. I could not believe it. And then they put their suits on and their dresses and go to church. Not that's a why you wonder, sweat. That's why you wonder why people without AC fucking smell like shit. I'll tell you what, that's one thing when, when we were in Spain. A lot of those people don't don't like air conditioning, man. Yeah. That's why, you know. But other than that, you know, we went to the Heineken Brewery. We went to the red light district. You didn't go to the blue light district? No, that's for you. I was told to stay away from the blue light district. Why? That's where all the trainees are. Why? You check them out. I'm sure they got. The fuck do I need to check them out for? I don't want to see that shit. No, oh, Leonard. I tell you what, speaking like, of that, I've been back like on you, the subject. Man. Yeah, let's I was looking at Backpage. Uh -huh. Man, oh man. Off of Yamato Road, and it sucks because they'll post it up. And then it's gone, and I don't know how to copy it down. Because I guess they'll get enough clientele just doing a once a week post. Mm -hmm. I don't blame this one in Spanish. It's at Boca Raton off Yamada Road. Oh my god. Unreal. I was thinking, man, even before work, you know, obviously I'm on the phone. Will they, come to, will they come to you since you don't have a car? 50 year. But I don't want them to come to me. That I, I had one. I picked out the street came Fuck over her outside. and she gave me a fucking dirty look. But What's that? No, it's better I'll come to them, but a real nice place, but she was an absolute ten. So head to toe. Beyond belief. It was beyond belief. What what why can't you just what is with you and Trent? I don't understand. Like You don't like pussy. Perversion. You don't like pussy. I do, but been there. why can't you find a, a ten that that has a vagina and not a dick? Because they act like dicks. Oh my god! If you're paying for it, what's the what the fuck is it? If you're gonna pay for a prostitute, why don't yeah, you? Yeah, but just... it, it can't be run of the mill basic. I don't like them, but the run of the mill basic thing is like boring. You know. Yeah, don't be basic. There's so many nurses <laughs> I can get involved with that hospital. It's not even funny. Not even funny. I come down that hallway. No, it's it's, they, uh, it's not stern. funny. It's fucking scary. And headstone. Yeah. Okay. Because I ignore them. They'll see me talking with a bike. They get fucking pissed off. Good. You know I wasn't taking fucking no for an answer today. Well, you know, yeah, I hated not to be a man of my word, but yeah, that's I tell you, that's a legitimate medical reason. The way I feel is just ungodly and horrible. What? Well, Taking all this shit, you're supposed to feel good. I don't understand. I do. What the fuck is the point of taking all that shit if, you if you're gonna take? If, if you feel that's what I'm yeah. taking in particular is with the fan about. So like, stop taking the shit if it makes you feel like that. What? But, the but fuck? on the other days, you feel incredible. But you got to take a few days off. So the days that you take off of the Fenabut is when you feel like shit. I don't take it Saturday, but it's weaning out of my system, so I'm, I'm flying around like a kite. Sunday's hard. Because I'm gonna go to the gym Sunday. But you go to work. It's a struggle to go through work. It's a struggle because I'm so sociable. It's so it, Wednesday and Thursday, people look at me Sunday and then they give me a dirty look. As why is this guy such a like a, you know his head's down? He's not even smiling at me. You're a total asshole. Sort of, yeah. So you're. I mean, <laughs> you like to fucking talk shit about the drug addicts. You are a fucking drug addict. Yeah, but I'm not, I have, a, I have a job, I'm not, oh, put me in rehab, I can't deal with life anymore, I'm going to kill myself, or I'm going to OD, yeah, I'm going to put it on society, that's what I, I've always said, and you believe, you believe it too, you do it, you be a man about it, you know, when you drink, you're, you're hopefully responsible enough not to fucking drive, that's why I don't have a car, you know, in case no, I do man, I, about. Hey, listen, Uber's, Uber's, Uber and Lyft, if I'm drinking, I take that, I'm not I'll tell you what scared me, I saw him. Look there's online. no reason. There's any these fucking assholes, like the celebrities or the ball players that get pulled over for DUIs, driving their Ferraris and shit. You got millions of fucking dollars. Why the fuck don't you have a driver? Why wouldn't you just have a fucking driver for because that? Because I think they're invincible. What's the fucking difference? Like uh, poor, so poor Venus stupid. Williams, you see her crying like a baby after killing that guy. No, I didn't see that. What happened? Venus Williams oh, no, killed the guy up on. Uh, 
Donald Ross Road up in uh, Palm Beach Palm Gardens. Beach, yeah, Palm Beach. That's where they live, Palm Beach Gardens. She was involved. She didn't get charged. It was well, like, just like your just like your buddy Bruce Jenner did that shit too. You don't hear anything about that. Yeah. Good. Women's privilege. Speaking of women's privilege, it's not a woman. I saw something it's online. Bruce Jenner. He's not a fucking women's woman. privilege. Well, you know they get, get out of here with that treatment. shit. Yeah, he's not very good. Nothing I fuck. And they gave him some here. fucking courage award or some bullshit a yeah, couple that, years ago. That's Obama for Because he wants to have a fucking vagina. Like, give me a fuck. He wants to be a... <laughs> yeah, I guess he's they, a cross-dresser. He's a like fucking some kind of courage. A, a RuPaul. There yeah, you go. Let's let's give him a fucking bravery award. Why? Get the fuck out of here. It's a creep fuck. That's why I went to this one. She goes, I'm a post-op trend So I says, what's that mean? She goes, I had the surgery. I said, goodbye. <laughs> They like invert your dick inside or some weird shit, right? But getting back to look online, girl in Miami, and it looks exactly like Christina Broccoli. Oh, here we go. With an this Uber driver. Fucking Christina Broccoli. She starts shit. this Uber driver, whatever. I don't know what happened. I guess she didn't want to pay or something. She was drunk. And she starts freaking out right in South Beach. She had these shorts on. Look it's it up. Go, it goes through PayPal. And you have to needs, pay. It's it was on camera. She kneed the driver in the nuts. That's great. Said she wasn't paid. She, then she went in his car and took out all the paperwork, threw it on the ground in the street, and started blowing everywhere. But look at it. She started blowing everybody? Uh, she looked She looked exactly like Christina. <clears throat> it, was, it was scary. You're fucking scary. Are you going to finish that shit? I have to. You're going to be throwing up after your leg workout. If you actually lift the weights today, so you're so used to that fucking little girls' gym, Planet Fucking Fitness. Yeah, I When's the last time you've had a fucking real workout? I train intensely there, but intensely. I got reprimanded the other day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why'd you eat all the fucking pizza? No, I went uh, grunting. Oh, please. Again, what if, I mean, it's a fucking gym. I'm taking this picture, that guy should be hung. Who? Whoever, whoever ratted you out yesterday. Fuck him. Dude, you you understand how this world is now. It's all a bunch of oversensitive bitches. Just, well, that's gonna you know, what, what do you think happened with the with Chuck fucking Basher? Because you called him a porch monkey. But, oh, it's okay for this fucking creep to call Jason a retard, but you yeah. can't call him a porch monkey. And Johnny <laughs> Depp for threatening Trump. Who? Johnny Depp threatening to assassinate Trump. <clears throat> Oh, really? I saw something about that. It's all fucking nonsense. Yeah, but little Venus killed somebody last week. A father of four. And she was at fault. And she, did, she did the fake tears. Was she drunk? Time. No. But she pulled out uh, where, where it's got the right away. She's got money. She'll get off. Just say, if you got yeah, enough, if you got enough money, endorsements. Yeah, if you got enough money, you're getting off whatever. It's fucking horse shit. Anyway, let's go work out. Finish your food. What in the fuck are you doing? Better finish this. You're gonna, why don't you just finish it up there? I don't think they give a shit if you eat. You carb loading? I'm having carb. Some barley has a lot of carbs? I don't think I've ever that's eaten that's that. That's complex, but. Very good athlete's food. And if anybody's a football player, make that drink. It's Bill Romanowski's favorite. Grind up barley and steak and drink it. With water. That's fucking disgusting. Who the fuck would want to do that? Try to do it and sip it. Ugh. Throw it again. You know, you fucking throw it up before you finish it. Your eyes are real fucking jaundiced today. Jesus Christ. I took a... You sure you're not having liver failure or heart failure? Well, if I do, even though my life on Earth is not complete yet. When will your life on Earth be complete? When you're 700 pounds ripped? Or when you meet fucking Christina? When I meet Christina and gaze into those eyes. You really are a scary It's like fuck. gazing into eternity. Jesus, look at the state of you. 
Good fucking God. You got a long way to go, man. It's, you're 11 weeks out. You know that, right? I'm not some dumb redneck that doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. He's going to fuck himself over. Who's that? Name names. Point fingers. I'm not one to name names, but... Bullshit. You're all... You're... You're... The king of fucking naming names. I'm the king of getting in ripped. Getting ripped. Yeah, all right. I believe you. I think you will. But you got to fucking... You got to get out of that plan of fitness and... Yeah, I know. You got to be able to lift some real weight, Hunter. Got to go balls to the wall with just screaming and yelling. Going heavy today, bully? No. Reprogramming. Haven't squatted in a while. Doing a 10 sets of 10. 100 reps with 135. Old school workout. The way guys used to train before World War II. 10 sets of 10. <laughs> old school. Let's see the quads. No. Why? They're undercover. Well, no shit. Fat pussy. Can you do the power lifter? There you go. Wide stance, power. What set is this? Oh, you one of those those little cucks that can't talk while they're lifting? I know it's hard. I don't want to fuck you up counting to ten. But I lose count, so I throw a two and a half over there. How the me. fuck do you lose? Ah, you lose count on what set you're on yeah. when you're doing ten sets. So I've done four sets of ten. And once I get five plate, five little coins over there, I'll start pulling one away. Jesus, you are a fucking simpleton. <laughs> you can't fucking keep track. Lenny's downstairs finishing his meal. Jason, Lenny is a fucking retard. Jason, Jason ran down to fucking fondle his balls and help him up. Jason's pretty lean. Yeah, he did get lean. He did. He's definitely losing weight. He's got no fucking muscle. No, he looks like a, just a skinny kid. Yeah, it's like, bodybuilding. You have to have fucking muscle. Is that Andrew's camera? Yeah. <sighs> Andrew's working. I had to go get it out of his mailbox today because the view the viewers are. Meant deprived, they're starved. They've been bothering the fuck out of us. I want to give uh, Kali Muscle a shout out. I heard you sucker punched Rich Biana. No, that was that was the other schmuck, Mac. Oh, okay, I get the other the other oversensitive pussy. All right, back to Kali Muscle. Kali Muscle's the the guy that called Jason a yeah. retard, and Lenny called him a porch monkey. Kali, I want to give you a heads up. I have some very rich, powerful white friends in California. If I show them that video, I could get you thrown right back in the joint. So I suggest you humble up. And if you want to, if you're willing to be a good boy and apologize, you could come to Florida and suck down some 40s of Colt 45 with me. <laughs> well. His, his alter ego, Chuck Basher, will be sucking something else. We'll be called 45. Little collie muscle. I guarantee. He'll probably give you the blowjob of your life. I guarantee you, I can drink four 40s of Colt 45 faster than you. And considering you grew up in the hood with no, no shoes, no <laughs> toys for Christmas, that should be an embarrassment. <laughs> How do you know where he grew up? Look some, at him, you can did tell. You, did you do some research on this moron? He is South Central if I've ever seen South Central. I think it's more of an ad. I think he's a he's he's another fucking I gotta go. phony. Go. So what do you, you're gonna you're gonna compete as a middleweight? Yeah. And how many pounds is that? 160, what do you have? 160 to 175? You gotta be between 160 and 175? Yeah. And what are you now? 185? Alright. 11 170. weeks, you'd be fine. Finally, I've been telling the guy to do middleweight for two years. Because yeah. there'll only be two people in the weight class, and he might actually get a trophy. Well, he's not listening to you. He's listening to his, his coaches. My coach is telling me what to do. Who's your coach now? Coach Kara. Kara? Yeah, she's hot. Yeah? Yeah. She lets you eat her monkey? Maybe. Maybe. All right, good. Finally. Do you like those bodybuilding chicks? No, she's a she's bikini. She's bikini. She's not bodybuilding. She's bikini. Man. She's right. not a bodybuilder. So she's bikini. 
Oh, so she doesn't get massive and no, have, she gets have like very a, lean. Have like a guy back. No, she's very slim and very lean. Yeah. Does she have hips? What? Hips? Or no yeah, hips. A lot of these bodybuilding chicks have fucking no hips. She's got an ass and hips. Good. Bury your face in it. Ah! You think she'll let you? Maybe. I'm a good boy and I win first place. You're a good boy. You win first place. Well, if you saw Dale, you know you're not getting first place. We're not going in the same weight class. I'm competing. I'm going to get first place in my weight class. You're making that claim right now. You're yeah. getting first place in your weight and middle weight. Yes. And what happens if you don't? Doesn't matter. I'll get. I'll, be, I'll beat some competitors because I'm gonna. Well, are we fucking, gonna put a wager on this? I'm gonna look fucking good and show. Good. He's gonna get a second place trophy out of two in the middleweights. <laughs> no, no, I don't think so. Hey. I'm gonna come out Maybe fucking no. phenomenal. Hey. Phenomenal shape. Good. I'm glad you're motivated finally. Time to win one good one. What do you think, sweaty tits? I'm here to encourage the great Jason Genova, the future of middleweight bodybuilding. Wow, you hear this, Jason? You're the future of The middle. future of middleweight. So, you actually gonna get a legit trophy or just a participation trophy a this legit year? Legit trophy. Good. Look, look at the vascularization. You fucking smell. Can you not project it's, your breath so much at me like pissing. that? It's pissing yeah, me. I eat is, a lot of butthole. Your, your breath is pissing. It smells like it. I like to lick out a girl's asshole <laughs> while I manually stimulate the clitoris with my fingers. And then right when she's about to squirt, she makes me put my mouth over her vagina and I swallow every last drop like a good boy. <laughs> All the women are wet right now, Jay. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Yeah. No shame, I love it. You guys are the fucking best.